Um, we'll take calls after I talk about Terry McCullough, and then I'll talk about all the hypocrisy in the national campaign uh, because of so much. Why start there, right? There's going to always be some hypocrisy that it's a bull I got to call out. Let me start with the headlines first. So Terry McCullough in Virginia, Democrat. And I forgot he was a Democrat as I was reading this article this morning because the behaviors that he was exhibiting were exactly that of a Republican. Said that, you know, he he struck down the electric chair provision in uh, a piece of legislation meant to uh, supplement their lack or their inability to get the necessary drugs to do lethal injections. And in the absence of lethal injections, Virginia said, well, hell, let's fire up old Sparky and start frying people. And so Terry McCullough, being a good human being, said, no, we're not going to use the electric chair. But what we can do is we can give uh, anonymity to the drug makers of, um, of, these, uh, of the lethal injection. <clears throat> and <clears throat> I need, uh, <clears throat> I need some, I forgot my tea. That's what I'm doing wrong. So he said, we need to give anonymity to these sites, to these, uh, to these companies that make the concoctions that we need for lethal injections. Because if we don't do that, then we're not going to be able to continue the death penalty in America and, and in Virginia rather. And then he said, this is an opportunity for legislators to participate in the solution instead of just being a part of the problem. Because if they don't participate in the solution, that means we're not going to be able to have capital punishment in Virginia. And I don't know if you read between all of his words, but in between Terry McCullough's words were, was, were, whatever, that we need to give and, and protect these, these companies from public scrutiny. Let them be anonymous so that we can keep our death penalty in Virginia. And you listen to his words saying that this is a solution. The solution is for us to give anonymity so that these companies never have to pay, uh, face public scrutiny. And if we don't do that, guys, we're not going to be able to kill people in Virginia anymore. <clears throat> in what world, in what society is ending the death penalty something that we should regret. Why not McCullough, McAuliffe, whatever. Why not Governor McAuliffe? Why not use this as an opportunity to end the death penalty? Because with all of the historical baggage that I'm not even prepared to list, I'm, there's plenty of sites to show you, plenty of, uh, of research to show you that the percentage of people who are innocent, the people who are exonerated, the people who are exonerated after the fact. Never mind all that. But this is a Democrat who says that the solution, instead of the solution being let's end the death penalty, the solution is let's give anonymity to companies who create these concoctions so that we can continue having the death penalty and we're supposed to unite blue? Well, Ben, he's good on everything else. He's good on this. He's good on that. Yeah, but when are we going to call them out on the things that they're not good on? Don't tell me that you're good on LGBTQ rights when you're bad on, on economic issues. Being a decent human being, not being a bigot, not being transphobic is not your cover to get away with all of your other neoliberal uh, wet dreams. And in this case, it is an eye for an eye. In this case, it is the fascination that a lot of Southern Democrats have, uh, particularly when I say this, I'm talking about Hillary Clinton. This fascination or this commitment, this unfettered commitment to the death penalty. And I still I still don't understand why. You know, what is what is their obsession with maintaining capital punishment despite all of the evidence that shows the number of innocent people we kill? But we better not primary him. We better not call him out. We need to be good Democrats and get in line and do what they say. 
again, tell me, what is the point of a label if that label has no principles?